recently so now i want like a really nice coffee bar setup so today we're gonna be setting up my little coffee bar i just bought this keurig i actually got it from target it can make iced or hot coffee which is freaking slay so let's open this bad boy up I got the white color because I just thought that would look so cute in this room. How cute is she? She's so cute. Let's go ahead and set up the little coffee bar. All right, guys, we're in my kitchen. This is where the coffee bar currently is. It looks like this, and honestly, it is not very cute. I really want a more like lighter aesthetic. It's looking a little sad, but my mom did put these things up, and I think they're really cute. Honestly, these decor are not that bad. I think it's just down here needs a little bit more, I don't know, like a clean aesthetic. are wondering where this cup is from i actually got it from walgreens chloe wants to be loud so she's gonna be joining us but like i said this is the best coffee creamer ever this is the coffee made cinnamon toast crud delicious mm, chloe mm. <laughs> yummy yummy coffee chloe wants to be in today's vlog so much my questy questy dog let me have my coffee in peace bitch WTF, where's your toy? Where's your toy? So today is kind of a slow day for me. I'm just like vibing out, you know? I finally got my cute little coffee bar. And later, I'm actually gonna go to a yoga sculpt class. So that's around 3 p.m. I wish it was earlier, but it's okay. 3 p.m. is still fine. I'm not scared to do the yoga sculpt class because yoga sculpt classes are hardcore. Like I'm gonna be dripping in sweat. Anyways, as you guys know, I finally launched my Bali trip tickets and everything. If you guys wanna book your tickets, you guys still can the link is down below they're gonna be available until july unless the spots fill up then there won't be any more tickets to get currently right now i have 12 extra spots i am so happy because i could only have 24 people come on this trip and the fact that i already have half of that is insane to me like i'm so happy i'm so grateful this is just so exciting like this is gonna be so much fun every day i'm getting so much more and more nervous i honestly didn't think anybody was gonna come to bali with me but the fact that i have people who are coming that is literally mind-boggling and it just proves to not let your fear get in the way of you trying new things achieving new goals <sighs> Besides that though, I actually really want to clean my room because I just bought this really cute and new mirror. Where I'm going to put it is literally a mystery because low-key I could put it in this little wall here or I can put it in my bedroom, which I kind of like the idea of it being in my bedroom. I don't know, I just feel like my bedroom is not that cute right now. So it's a wavy mirror. It's one of those really like aesthetic looking ones. I actually bought it from Home Goods, So stay tuned because my dad is picking it up for me later. But I have like a whole bunch of boxes in my room. So I think I want to move those and throw them into this living room even though that'll make this living room a little bit cluttered it's been a while since i've showed you guys chloe's tricks <laughs> all right chloe this is your time come here sit oh my gosh she's broken guys high five sit that's not sit she's trying to do bang like she's getting to the end sit no no touch oh my god you're doing it all bad spin 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 <laughs> Guys, she's broken. To be fair, I haven't done tricks with Chloe in a while, so she might be confused because usually I'll just be like, bang! So now I think she forgot everything else. In conclusion, stay in a routine with your dog. Oh, la -di -da -di -da. Bang! Good job! If you guys look over here, I have some boxes inside or clothes that I posted in for my Poshmark. And so I'm selling all of these items. But in this corner, it's just looking really messy. Like I thought it was all gonna go so fast, but it did not because I suck at promoting my clothes. So we're gonna throw these in the living room so that they're the living room's problem, but not my bedroom's problem. <laughs> This 
corner is now empty. God bless because now this is gonna make a really cute spot for my mirror. Also, I have a whole bunch of boxes. Hope I lock Chloe out. My bad girlfriend. Here's where I put the boxes. God bless, they're all white. It's not an eyesore. So I got these boxes from Ikea. So they're just so clean and minimalistic. So these are gonna be my Poshmark inventory. We're washing the sheets right now. Anyways, this is my closet. I have hella boxes right now. That's clean laundry, dirty laundry. Anyways, my closet is really packed. It's really full. But one of the biggest reasons why it's super like cluttered is because I have boxes of clothes in there full of clothes that I don't want anymore that I want to sell too or like just get rid of. So we're gonna put those boxes in the living room because having them in my closet, it's just an eyesore. It's not gonna be done for a while. So for now, this side is unrenovated, super janky, but this side, super cute and aesthetic. Also, my Poshmark is at Sandy Diana Bang if you guys want to check it out. Because most of it is like Princess Polly, White Fox Boutique. <laughs> Let's talk about candles because a girly loves candles. So this is the Better Homes and Garden Lavender and Lemonade. One of my absolute favorite candles, as you guys can tell. It's starting to like turn black and stuff. So recently I've been getting kind of scared to use it because I'm like, what? Is it gonna burn down my house? Anyways, they used to sell this at Target, but I haven't been able to find it. I was trying to find this the other day and it turns out they only sell it at Walmart now because I could only find it at Walmart. I went to Walmart and tried to find it. Guess what? It wasn't in stock, but you know what I did find? So the reason I like this is because it smells like watermelon, even though it doesn't say watermelon, completely discard its name. Beautiful watermelon. Anyways, I went to Walmart and this is what I found. I found this candle. It is the Mainstays Juicy Watermelon. This is a literal fucking dupe. Oh my god, the way I want to just put my teeth in here and like. But anyways, yeah, these are my favorite candles. But I need to get ready for my nice little scope class. Let's see what outfit I end up choosing for today. I know I'm gonna be super super sweaty, so I definitely want to wear some shorts. Oh my god, look. Oh my god. Oh my god. How cute! Alright guys, here's the outfit I decided to wear for today's class. It's super cute, you know, just a black simple fit. Black yoga shorts from Garage, this sports bra is from Amazon, and then some sleeves just to cover my arms a little bit, but I know I'm gonna take it off because I'm gonna get so hot. Falling deeper, cold and nights that no more shit on. Keep that eggy and no more kid on. Just on this hat, I wish you go. Keep them on hand and go to him. No, I can't, just can't. Cause your name, I'm burned. Not your name, got some burned. Tabat your I just finished that workout class. Guys, that shit killed me. I am literally sweating so much. I'm gonna take this jacket off. I have no heater on. It is winter outside and I cannot wear a jacket. Okay, it is so hot. But do I feel very successful? Yes, that was such a fun class honestly i love coming here if you guys notice whenever i go do yoga i always come to this studio because i really really love the dance or dance teacher the yoga instructor she's so sweet i love her literally during the class she was like yes sandy 
and I'm just here like, yes, I suck. But I'm here for me and the fact that you're cheering me on, it just makes me feel very proud of myself. And that's the type of instructors we need. Anyways, I feel so good. I feel so productive. I've honestly been having a very good day today because I actually woke up and I was outside for a little bit and I really just like let the sun sink into my face. I walked and I just made that walk so intentional. And ever since then, this morning, I've just been having such a good day. So for 2024, we are making every single day intentional every moment intentional it just sets you on such a good vibration hello guys i just went to the grocery store and i bought a few things recently i have not been buying in bulk i literally just buy what i need so here's a little haul what time is it where did my phone go okay I actually have no idea what time it is. What the fuck? It's 5.16, so I'm gonna cook some dinner. Tonight, I'm craving some ground beef, so I'm gonna make a ground beef stir-fry. Super easy. This is such a meal prepping recipe. This really is a meal prep recipe, but it's recently been my favorite thing to eat, so it's just ground beef and mixed vegetables, and this is just like corn, beans, carrots. Super simple, super easy. It's giving boy meal, honestly, but it's delicious. I got some bread. This is honey wheat bread. This is so good, and I got this so I can make some avocado toast in the morning. Of course, I have some avocado, a lime too, because there's like this really delicious snack recipe that Hmong people love to eat. I'm sure Lao people eat this, Thai people eat this. It's just, my mouth is watery just thinking about this. I might make this little snack later, but yeah, avocados. Of course, just got some protein yogurt. This is the Oikos 20 gram. This is mixed berries. Then I got this. These are chicken tenders. These are so clutch. If you guys look here, 11 grams of protein per strip. And so if you just have two strips, that's 22 grams of protein. Light work, 180 calories. In my opinion, I think it's like an easy way to like get protein in instead of going to get fast food. Like not the healthiest, but it's like not bad, you know? You still get your protein. a little bit of youtube while i eat first bite you first mm. do not sleep on the chicken powder it's literally key mm. oh my god that was hot recently i've been watching a lot of stephanie sue tell me why her videos are so good number one because she's such a good storyteller but number two i've been getting the heebie-jeebies after like every video she's so good at storytelling that like after the video i get scared the stories she tells are just so scary my dad has literally seen all of these episodes story this morning and literally everybody was like you belong on singles inferno this photo looks like it was from a show huh y'all telling me i'm that cute like i look like i could be on a show let's make it happen <laughs> here's the photo i'm talking about chloe let me know what you guys think am i so cute and angelical that i could be on a show stop guys you guys are making my head big anyways my nail is literally about to fall off which is so annoying i texted Shar if she wanted to do my nails because i know she's been wanting to do so update it's the next day and guess what y'all y'all see that Shar did my nails guys and she literally did so good they look so cute, so natural, like, oh my god. She found my shade of nude. It is literally so cute and natural. I am obsessed. Like, Shar, you ate 
you ate so if you ever become a nail tech i will be your customer period i just got out the shower let's do a quick little skincare routine we're gonna use the vita serum by urban calm this has 10 percent niacinamide and fermented mung bean i look insane i'm gonna blow dry my hair in a bit i'm gonna use my urban calm soft essence Mwah. i love this stuff i was supposed to wear this first but i put the serum on first so we're just gonna put this on second today i am full-heartedly an essence girly now like as someone who loves my skin super hydrated ever since i started using essence i don't think i could ever go back okay i look like a boy anyways the hydration with essence is game changer let's put on some moisturizer i'm gonna use the haru haru wonder centella phyto and five peptide concentrate cream this is so crazy hydrating i would highly recommend it if you guys need a really good moisturizer like y'all know i don't play when it comes to moisturizers like i love a good moisturizer we're gonna finish off the night routine with a little a little oil okay this is the haru haru wonder black rice facial oil one of you guys commented that i look like i have glass skin thank you i would like to thank this bad boy if you want your glass skin look seriously just apply like facial oil plus when you apply this and you wake up in the mornings your skin is just so soft skin is hydrated so that is the skincare i chose to do today now we're gonna go ahead and blow dry my hair real quick if you guys watch my videos you guys will know a lot of my hair tools are by t3 this hair dryer can literally dry my hair in four minutes that's insane i'm gonna use the away hair oil i like to do two pumps of this lather it but i like to focus it on my ends i like to give my head a little massage Anyways, we're gonna do a cute little, <laughs> a little light therapy. This is from Skin Gym. You guys can actually get it at Ulta. So it's like a light therapy mask, right? You put it on for like 15 to 30 minutes, depending on whatever you wanna do. There's three light settings. So each color has like a little specialty. The red light is super popular. I know that, but red light, it helps with like redness, anti-aging. The blue is good for acne prone skin, people with a lot of zits, pimples. And then there's amber, which is gonna help with dull skin to look more hydrated more bright and so i have decided i'm gonna do the amber one because i really want my skin to look glowy that's like my most important thing i prioritize is always hydration and glowy skin oh my god oh my gosh i feel like i'm in a really cool movie wow Mm, yeah, you guys see me? I feel like a robot. If a person was in front of me right now, I could see their skeleton. We got the mirror. <laughs> it looks so good. All right, thank you, Dad. Guys, <laughs> it's so cute. My room is just complete now. I've allowed it to thaw. <laughs> it's like really cold outside, so it got really like foggy. Let's take the tag off of it. the final result guys i'm not gonna lie this mirror makes me look so skinny like my face looks so like squished i don't know is it just me so i did buy this mirror from home guys but the brand is rachel zoe in case you guys are curious look at her she's just so beautiful i paid 250 dollars for this mirror i feel like i got such a good deal on this and i'm gonna have this mirror forever it's just so cute i low-key manifested this mirror because recently i've been watching Brittany lee's videos and i'm just here like her living room mirror is so cute like i want it so bad and I have something similar, so I'm really happy. Anyways, guys, that is it for today's video. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. I'm gonna be doing post notification shout outs again if you guys remember I used to do that. So if you guys want a shout out at the end of all my videos, make sure to subscribe, turn on the post notification bell, and comment down below Buttercup. That's all you guys have to do to get a shout out. And yes, I know when you guys are subscribed and I know when you guys have the bell on. Anyways, thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog and I'll see you guys next week. Bye. Mwah.